Well, as Angie Rodican from Medical Weight Loss Centers has told us in the past, obesity is a symptom of a chronic medical illness caused by abnormal body chemistry. If you just treat the symptoms and not the underlying disease, your weight is guaranteed to come back. Well, this year we are following two medical weight loss patients. Last time Andy was on, we met James, and today we have the luxury of meeting Teresa Ratcliffe. They're both here today. Andy, great to have you Hi, back. Good to see you. And Teresa, welcome. Great Thank to have you. you. Thanks so much. Let's start with you, Andy. When Teresa walked into your office, what did you find out about her body chemistry? Well, first I found a very motivated but a very frustrated patient, and her body chemistry, frankly, was really... Um, not good. Her blood sugars were one of the highest I've ever seen. She had insulin resistance, high triglycerides, high blood pressure, and she had not been to her doctor in a while. Wow. So you were feeling kind of sluggish and yes. unhealthy. Yes, very much so. so. So let's talk a little bit about the body chemistry, the abnormal body chemistry that you found. I mean, it was keeping her from actually losing mm -hmm. the weight. Right. Her blood sugars were one of the highest I've seen in the last five years of practicing. And when your blood sugar's up, your insulin levels are high. Insulin is the fat storing hormone. So we fixed the body chemistry to her insulin, and she's averaging five pounds per week. Uh, really? In seven weeks, her, her blood sugars are almost normal. Her blood pressure has dropped to normal. Her triglycerides are normal, and she's um, a star patient. A star patient. Now Yay. she looks like, smiles from ear to ear. So, Teresa, what was it about for you? I mean, what was it that made you want to lose that weight? I just, I was sluggish, uh, tired, that I call it carb drunk. Uh, eating carbs, hitting that wall, just not feeling good at all. I'm sure my sugar was very, very elevated. So let's talk about this, Annie. What was her highest weight then, or what was your highest weight when she came into you? What did she weigh in as? She was, what was her weight? 295. 295. Mm -hmm. Her goal weight is 160. Mm -hmm. um, she's lost 35 pounds. Wow. Her fasting blood sugar um, went from 255 to 147, which is. A, a blood sugar of 255 is like having molasses in your blood, sticky, sticky, sticky. Wow. So diabetes is a microvascular disease, brain, kidneys, heart, um, feet, toes, all those microscopic vessels get clogged, tissue dies downstream, and we start slowly but surely, surely getting uh, more and more disease processes. And Andy, you say it's not so much about the amount of weight as much as it is about the body fat. And right. why, why so? Well, because if you think about it, weight is water, muscle, and fat. If you think about a boxer the night before the weigh-in, they lose 20 pounds. They're not right. losing 20 pounds of fat. They're dehydrating. So we track body composition analysis. Fat is the bad actor. Fat, the fat cell produces 100 hormones that cause havoc throughout the body, uh, which is why you absolutely need a medical specialist following you. This is wow. not just about losing weight. You want to mm -hmm. lose fat. That's really important. Right. Teresa, how are you feeling right now? I mean, how, how are you able to get around? I feel wonderful. I didn't realize how sick I was mm. until I started this program and, you know, got my numbers. I, I really didn't realize the bad shape I was in. And so grateful that I was able to meet Andy and get involved in this program. It's been a lifesaver for and me, is, truly. It, that's, I mean, that had to be really scary, knowing that you want, you know, you were at risk. I mean, your life was at risk. Oh, I was in total denial. You know, I was avoiding my doctor. I was probably ready to go on, you know, insulin. I'm sure. And you say you find that all the time at medical weight loss centers. Most of our patients haven't been to the doctor in two and three years, and I look at their first set of labs and I say, you're diabetic, you're mm -hmm. hypothyroid, you know, your insulin's through the roof, and um, there's good news, bad news. Bad news, yes, you are sick. Good news is you're here and you're in the right place, and we're going to easily be able to correct this and fix this if you follow the program. And Andy, I want to give you an opportunity to share with our viewers, because you really are about making sure that you monitor people. Let's talk mm -hmm. about your first initial visit. What happens when someone walks in? First visit, you're going to get, we're going to review a whole panel of lab values. We're going to do an EKG. We're going to do your body composition analysis, your metabolic testing. We can actually tell how many calories you burn through a test that we have done. And we're going to sit down and review your medical history, all of your medications. A lot of medications cause weight gain, and people mm -hmm. don't realize that. They've been on a medication that's caused 35, 35 pounds weight gain in about a month, and we can make a simple switch. Wow. Um, again, being a medical program, I can take people off medications, put people on new medications, or switch medications that might be more, more weight neutral. And what would you say would be the biggest difference between commercial weight loss centers and medical weight loss centers? Well, that's pretty easy. The Centers for Disease Control states that if you go on a, a commercial weight loss program that is not medically supervised, you have about a 5% chance of success. Long-term wow. success is 5% weight loss in one year. If you go on a medically supervised weight loss program with a medical weight loss specialist, 80% chance. Good to know. So... The average person spends $533 per year on weight loss products. So if you're going to Vegas with $533, which, which, which odds would you take? 5%? <laughs> 
80%. It's kind of a no-brainer. It is a no-brainer. This is an illness that needs to be treated as an illness. And it's a passion for you. It's the number one you. preventable killer in the United States right now. We know it. We, it's a passion for you. I know helping Absolute, people. Absolutely. Well, let's put the information on the screen. We have some exciting stuff for folks. Listen, if you would like to log onto our website, we want you to click on WTNH.com. Go to Connecticut Style, and we've got an Ask Andy page. You can ask Andy any questions you want to know about weight loss, and we might be able to get all those answered answers for you right here on Connecticut Style Live. Thank you so very much for being Thanks, here. Desiree. And again, folks, if you want to contact him directly, it is Medical Weight Loss Centers. They're located in East Haven. That number is on your screen, and their website is right there for you. If you missed it, we've got you covered. Thank you both so very much Thank for being you. here. Thanks, we appreciate it. Always a pleasure. All right, don't go anywhere. We've got more Connecticut style coming up right after this. Stick around.